हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द सीरीज ऑन फेमस हीरोइंस इन द प्लेस ऑफ विलियम शेक्सपियर एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस जूलियट कैपुलेट फ्रॉम द प्ले रोमियो एंड जूलियट इंट्रोडक्शन जूलियट कैपुलेट इज वन ऑफ द सेंट्रल करेक्टर्स इन विलियम शेक्सपियर्स ट्रेजिडी रोमियो जूलियट शी इज़ अ यंग नोबल वुमन ऑफ वेरोना only 13 years old at the play's beginning as the daughter of lord and lady capulet she belongs to one of the two feuding families in the city the capulets characteristics youthful at just 13 years old juliet represents the innocence and impulsiveness of youth her actions throughout the play are driven by a passionate and intense love that she experiences for the first time passionate juliet's love for romeo is profound and all consuming despite the short time they know each other she commits herself entirely to him willing to defy her family and societal expectations quote my bounty is as boundless as the sea my love as deep the more i give thee the more i have for both are infinite act 2 scene 2 determined once she decides to be with romeo juliet shows remarkable determination she resists her parents' wishes for her to marry paris and makes bold decisions to ensure she can be with romeo quote if all else fail myself have power to die act 3 scene 5 intelligent and witty juliet exhibits intelligence and wit especially in her interactions with romeo her language is rich with poetic imagery demonstrating a maturity and depth of thought beyond her years quote good pilgrim you do wrong your hand too much which mannerly devotion shows in this for saints have hands that pilgrims hands do touch and palm to palm is holy palmer's kiss act 1 scene 5 courageous juliet's courage is evident in her willingness to take drastic steps to be with romeo including faking her own oath she confronts her fears head on whether it's taking a potion with uncertain effects or ultimately choosing to end her life coat what if it be a poison which the friar certainly hath ministered to have me dead lest in this marriage he should be dishonored because he married me before to romeo i fear it is and yet me thinks it should not for he hath still been tried a holy man act 4 scene 3 strength loyalty Juliet's loyalty to Romeo is unwavering even when faced with overwhelming pressure from her family to marry Paris. She remains steadfast in her commitment to Romeo. Quote, "O oh God, I have an ill divining soul. Methinks I see thee now thou art so low as one dead in the bottom of a tomb." Act 3, scene 5. Resourcefulness Juliet's ability to think quickly and find solutions to her problems is notable. She devises a plan with Friar Lawrence to avoid marrying Paris and reunite with Romeo. Quote, "Give me, give me, or oh, tell not me of fear." Act 4, scene 1. Emotional depth. Despite her youth, Juliet possesses a profound emotional depth. Her capacity for love grief and despair is intense and authentic making her a deeply sympathetic character quote my only love sprung from my only hate too early seen unknown and known too late act 1 scene 5 flaws impulsiveness juliet's youth contributes to her impulsive nature her quick decision to marry romeo after knowing him for just a few hours exemplifies this her impulsiveness 
often leads to hasty actions without fully considering the consequences. Quote, it is too rash, too unadvised, too sudden, too like the lightning, which doth cease to be, ere one can say it lightens. Act 2, Scene 2 Naivety Juliet's innocence and lack of worldly experience can make her naive. She underestimates the danger posed by the feud between their families and the complexities of the world around her. Quote, What's in a name? That which we call a rose by any other name would smell as sweet. Act 2, Scene 2 Over-reliance on Romeo Juliet's intense love for Romeo becomes a source of vulnerability. Her identity and decisions are closely tied to him and she struggles to envision a future without him. Quote, yeah, noise, then I'll be brief. O oh, happy dagger, this is thy sheath, there rust, and let me die. Act 5, Scene 3 Relationships Romeo Montague Juliet's relation with Romeo is the centerpiece of the play. Their love is immediate and intense. Transcending their family's feud, their bond grows rapidly from infatuation to a deep, sacrificial love. Quote, My husband lives that Tybalt would have slain and Tybalt's dead that would have slain my husband. Act 3, Scene 2 The Nurse Juliet shares a close bond with her nurse who has cared for her since infancy. The nurse acts as a confidant and messenger between Juliet and Romeo. However, the nurse's practical and sometimes crude perspective on love eventually clashes with Juliet's idealism. Quote, Thou and my bosom henceforth shall be twain. Act 3, Scene 5 Lord and Lady Capulet Juliet's relationship with her parents is strained. They have clear expectations for her, particularly regarding her marriage to Paris. Juliet's defiance of these expectations creates tension and conflict. Quote, He shall not take me there, a joyful bride. Act 3, Scene 5 Development Juliet undergoes significant development throughout the play. She begins as a sheltered and obedient daughter, but quickly matures as she falls in love with Romeo. Her journey is marked by a series of bold and increasingly desperate decisions. Juliet's evolution is driven by her love for Romeo and the challenges she faces, revealing her strength, resolve, and capacity for deep emotion. Tragic Flaw Juliet's tragic flaw is her impulsive and passionate nature. Her intense love for Romeo, while beautiful, leads her to make rash decisions. The culmination of these decisions is her tragic end, choosing to die rather than live without Romeo. Her death is a poignant reminder of the devastating consequences of their family's feud and the purity and intensity of young love. Conclusion Juliet Capulet remains one of Shakespeare's most beloved and tragic heroines, embodying the themes of love, conflict, and the loss of innocence. Her character continues to resonate with audiences for her depth, complexity, and the timeless nature of her story. So this was the discussion on the character of Juliet Capulet in Shakespeare's play Romeo and Juliet. We will meet in the next video and discuss some other character. Until then, goodbye and thank you.